So um, this is the vein with this big black circular dot here. This is the vein that's not working properly. Okay, you're gonna feel a little pinched down here, okay? So we're gonna get access into the vein. And so on the uh, screen there, you can see the needle going into the vein. Yeah, got it. There we go. Perfect. So here's the laser fiber, and this is what we use to laser the vein. So it shoots out of this top here, and this is what goes into the catheter here. So on the screen, Kyle, you can see here's that needle that's bouncing, and then all that black stuff is just the numbing solution going in around the vein. So the numbing cream really helps keep the patient comfortable, and of course we're talking to them, so there's such a thing as verbal anesthesia. Yeah. yeah keeps your mind off so you can see it's firing on the screen right there the bright white that's the laser firing and then we just compress the vein at the tippy top because you're really you're not I mean you're close to the deep veins but you're not in the deep veins so you want to make sure that um, you're in a safe location away from the deep veins we've obviously numbed all the way around are you feeling anything you're doing comfortable so she's comfortable because we've numbed all the way around the heat at the laser from the laser is very 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 hot and so we want to make sure that the patient's really comfortable during the procedure so we're starting here because the source is up here and it goes back down so blood is supposed to travel up towards the heart to get recirculated but hers was actually falling back downwards in this vein that's why she was getting these bulging veins here these skin changes as well and then we're going to come up to the top of the vein here where it meets the deep veins and just make sure that the deep vein, which is the Mickey Mouse there, yeah. and we just make sure his face squishes, which it does, which is good.